sausage rolls. This is the ultimate tasty snack. It's all about really well seasoned sausage meat. I use lots of lovely mixed herbs in mine and also a wonderful flaky pastry. The trick there is to use lots of egg wash over the top so it becomes really nice and flaky and golden. If you enjoy my video, hit the like button. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. I'm so close to my 1,000 subscribers on the Foodie Kitchen Review. Let's dive straight in and I'll show you how to do the most amazing sausage rolls. First step, sausages. Get yourself some really good quality sausages. I got mine from my local supermarket. Six sausages, absolutely perfect. Use a sharp knife and just cut them open and scoop out all of that lovely sausage meat. I've opted for plain sausage, so then I know exactly what's going in them. Once all that sausage meat is out, you can use a bit of red onion. You could use white onion as well. You could grate this, but just for speed, I'm using a mini processor here. Blitz until the onion is quite small. And then I use three herbs. I use rosemary, sage, and thyme. I break all of this up and then use the mixer to blend all of this. Lovely, so we've got our minced red onion and herbs. We go back to our sausage meat. We generously season this with salt and pepper and then we add our onions and herbs. Use our spatula to give this a really good mix around, make sure everything's really nicely distributed. The easiest way I find to do this is split the sausage meat in half, flour your work surface, and then roll this into a nice long sausage. You can use the flour, otherwise it may stick a little bit to the board. Once you've got the sausage meat rolled out, you can then move on to your pastry. Now, if I was a proper chef or had a little bit more time, I would make my own puff pastry. Because this is a weeknight, I've just gone for the easier option, which is a bit of puff pastry from the supermarket. Do I care? No, not really. But it's convenient and it will work a treat. Take this puff pastry, split it in half lengthways, use a little bit of flour, and then pop your sausage meat right in the middle. Use a little bit of egg wash just on the end and then roll this sausage around and then seal on the underside. You can do this with the second sausage as well. Use your hands just to gently sculpt this sausage just so you get a really nice shape. And then you can use a knife and just cut these a few centimeters apart to form a beautiful mini sausage roll. The next stage is using a tray. I've used a bit of parchment paper. If you didn't use the parchment paper, the sausages will get quite uh, stuck to the tray, which isn't ideal. Use parchment paper, saving the washing up, happy days. And then use a good amount of egg wash. Make sure you're nice and generous with the egg wash, just so the pastry becomes really nice and golden. Then using some scissors, you can cut three snips from the top. This looks quite pretty, but most importantly, it lets that air out so they cook really nice and evenly in the oven. Now, you want to bake these for 20, 25 minutes on a 220 degree oven. Delicious sausage rolls. This is where it's at. Beautifully seasoned sausage meat with lots of herbs and a wonderful golden flaky pastry. You can see from the color of these, they look absolutely phenomenal. I can't wait any longer. I need to dive in and taste one. Mm. That does not disappoint the tastiest sausage roll ever. Even though they're mini sausage rolls, you still get a wonderful amount of well-seasoned mincemeat and the golden flaky pastry. Eating them warm is just a real delight. Thank you to all of my regular subscribers today. Remember, smash that like button. And if you are new to the channel, subscribe for new foodie content every week. Until next time, fellow foodies, happy cooking.